Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero on the PlayStation 5. So in today's episode, we're going to be going over to the last known position of that pilot. mech pilot. Before we do, though, we're going to eat something real quick. Because we're going on a long-ass trip. Yeah, this is going to be a journey, guys. All right, so I'm just trying to pick which fish I want to eat. They're Could go for any of them, but you. I kind of feel like a boomerang fish. I feel like throwing a boomerang fish. It just doesn't work the way you expect it to in this one. All right, so let's get this guy cooked. It just doesn't look tasty. He doesn't. He really doesn't. It looks chewy and tough. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you know what? This here fabricator works wonders. Yeah, Wish we had a fabricator in our house. Behind it, but whatever. Uh, apparently we still need a bit of water, guys. So let's go ahead and drink. We'll drink this little one. And then maybe grab one more here. In our storage before we go. We'll get one more of those little ones. Just make sure we got plenty of food and water since, again, as Stink said, this is going to be a journey. We do have batteries. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Yep. I brought, I brought the batteries. I brought uh, two extra batteries. Hopefully that's enough. We'll see, guys. Uh-oh. Yeah, I see Kitty it. Fish. I don't know why you call them kitty fish. They only look like cats. We need to find something else to Get call them. Get away from him. I need to figure out what he is. Because he, he got like a crocodile tail. Like, there's nothing kitty-ish about him. Yeah, no. Like, his, his mouth is very, like... Kind of like a bird, but... Have we scanned him yet? I think we did. I feel like we did, we yeah. We tried to. But what was his name? So we can just call him his that. His name was Kitty Fish. Because he doesn't look like a cat, Kyle Jinx. Kyle the Kitty Fish. Kyle the Kitty Fish. Kitty <laughs> Fish. I'll call him Pussy. Come here, Pussy. I feel like... like we did scan him. Yeah. Oh, he is yeah, angry at me. This video is going to be cut short. <laughs> huh. Yeah. We definitely scanned him. But I don't know what his name is. Oh, well. It's probably in our little mm -hmm. data thing. Yeah, but thing. it's in our data thing. We should probably leave. He's really actually not that aggressive. Before Kitty Flipper gets all pissed off. Like, as much as I was harassing him. <laughs> he he's just really... doesn't like being scanned, that's all. Yeah. You don't scan my ass. Ask well, permission yeah. first. It's very invasive. It's like at, uh, when you go to the airport. Oh, I never yeah. did delete this. How do you delete this? Remove. <laughs> you can't. You're stuck with it forever. You know what? I think we had that issue in the last game, too. Like, I could, I wasn't able to delete it. You can't. Those are you your got, memories. Yep, forever. That's your picture forever. I'm looking in the... I'm looking in here in the menu, trying to find what the damn thing was called. It's got to be in the research, right? Indigenous life forms. That'd be in the uh, maybe carnivores. I, guess, I assume he's a carnivore. Oh, cryptosuchus. There he is. He's a large shark-like beast, easily identifiable by its carapace of thin, bony plates. Yeah, it's not very cat-like. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's got four legs and a tail, doesn't he? <laughs> he does. Are cats the only ones that have four le legs and a and tail? Yes. There are a lot of them. Yeah, Look at them. This is like their breeding grounds. Some serious kitty fish territory. Mm -hmm. We got one, two, three, four in this area. Ooh. What's this purple stuff? It seems hot. Seems hot. I'm going to touch it. Whoa. Yeah, yep. It's hot. Your butt. It was worth it. Good thing you brought that first aid kit. It does seem like <laughs> oh, a breeding no. ground. It's like eggs and shit all over the place. Yeah, it kind of does feel like this is, and it's real warm, you know, so yeah. that'd be a great place to raise your young and mm -hmm. keep your eggs warm. How deep are we going to have to go? We might not have the equipment for oh, this. No. That would be a bummer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we all plan to do this and then we'll be able to do it. I'll try, guys. We'll see how deep we can go. What we might end up having to do is like is that something new mm. well those plants are something oh, new that's, that's new. something new is he friendly uh, I'm scared. Hmm. yeah we are like deep too seems i mean like we're not just deep, a whale but... yeah he seems like he's just eating like uh little small fish like yeah, things like the ambient fish i feel like he's a friendly let's make a new friend he's pretty oops Let's scan him. Oh no, he's got kind of he's a, a glow whale. face. He's a glow whale. He's a whale, Jinx. He's a glow whale. There aren't, are there any whales that are aggressive? I don't think so. 
Killer whales. Killer whales aren't <laughs> whales, though. They're dolphins. They're, they're kind of like dolphins. So I, I don't think there are any whales that, get sucked up in those I mean, mouths. now, given whales will be aggressive if you attack them, they can be incredibly aggressive when you're... Oh, you can pet him? Can you? You can interact with them. Oh, my goodness. Why are we sticking our He's fingers so all nice. up in his eyes? That just seems rude. He's looking Are at us. Are we friends now? I think so. Oh, he's Look at he's, he's smiling at us. I feel like we just made a new friend. Whoa, I feel like that not is a not a friend though. <laughs> we haven't scanned him yet. <laughs> Damn it. Get your knife out. Shank him. I'm trying to scan him. I thought the whale We're going to need to use. Yeah, that whale didn't do shit. He's like, hey, you're on your own, buddy. <laughs> this ain't got nothing to do with me. All right, we need to scan this guy. He's a brute shark. Oh. He is a dick. Mm -hmm, so that makes sense why he's so aggressive. You don't have a name like Brute Shark unless you're aggressive. Unless you're a fucking brute. Mm -hmm, and look at them teeth. Oof. Common shark-like predator with low intelligence. <laughs> well, that's rude. No wonder he's such a brute. Oh, <laughs> Everybody's shit. calling him stupid. <laughs> you can jump on that lily pad. I guess we get up there. I'm really regretting not having brought... Oh, I should have got a bigger one. Can I... Oh, I can. Look at this. Look at you go. A mature lily pad. You can scan it. Really regretting not having brought more uh, med kits now. Yeah. Yeah, we're not doing so well. It's kind of dangerous out here. Mm hmm. I like the lily pads, though, and you can, like, hop back, you know, from one to the other. And... I want a lily pad house. Yeah, we could make a lily pad house. We we're just talking about base building. All right, so what we'd want to do is just like get right over it, and then we'll see exactly how deep it is. It looks like it's gonna be like 200 something meters. That might be beyond our abilities. I don't know. Yeah, that's pretty deep. Yeah, I don't know if we'll be able to get down that far, guys. We'll see. We'll try. We'll make an attempt. Remember, we do have our uh, little air uh, bladder thing to to take us up the top quickly. Yeah, like this the is. Whale singing. Well, you know what? It's not quite 200. We might be able to make it, guys. All right, so let's get a, a good breath of air. Let's get this out. We only got 11% battery yeah. left for we got to switch, but that's okay. All right, let's go. All right, so we're going down. We need to go straight down. No playing around. Because remember, once we hit 100, our oxygen efficiency is going to drop. Warning. Passing 100 meters. Okay. Oxygen efficiency Come decreased. On. We might be able to make it. Yeah, but how much are we going to be able to explore? Oh, true. Warning. Passing 200 yeah, and then once you get to 200 meters, it gets really bad. Yeah, I feel like we just don't have the yeah. ability to explore this. Because I think this is where we need to go. Yeah, we got to go. Warning. 30 seconds All right, of let's uh, ascend to the top. Ooh, he was trying to, to he was going to steal this from me. Can you imagine if he stole this from me? <laughs> oh, is that a monkey? Yeah, those oh. are the sea monkeys. Oh, it didn't even get us all the way up there. Ran out of air. Ran out of air. All right, so that's kind of unfortunate. Cause yeah, I don't think uh, I don't think we're gonna be able to explore it. I don't know what we needed to do there. I thought maybe it might be something that we can just go, go real quick and, and like grab up whatever we needed to grab. But you know, I, I don't think we're gonna be able to do this, guys. Too bad the whale can't give us a ride. Mm hmm Thought we had a real bond there. Or like if he could carry oxygen down for me, we'll <laughs> like. I'll put my mouth on his, he'll put his mouth on me. Blow hole. Yeah, <laughs> give me his blowhole. I'm gonna suck the Don't get your mind out of the gritter, you sick peoples. <laughs> uh, well, we have these down here. Yeah. If you can find another one of those, we might be able to make it. Looks like that's a no, though. Maybe you're gonna get lost and die. Well, I wasn't planning on getting Who's lost. For you? I would love to see what happens <laughs> when they take this from us, though. You die. I mean, yeah, we die, but I mean, like. Warning. I know. 30 seconds of I know. Oxygen We're going. So you don't know. Okay, hold up. We're going to get the little bladder thing out. <laughs> Maybe. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Oxygen. We're just barely making it here, guys. So you're going to pass out. We got it. Ah, we made it. Yeah, it's too deep. Yeah, it's too deep. Whoa. Did you see <laughs> yeah. how high we jumped? That was incredible. I was like, what in the hell was going on? Mm-hmm. All right, guys. So clearly we are uh, not equipped to do this shit yet. Either we need to get, first of all, that suit that would allow us to go that deep would be helpful. Another option is to try and get that vehicle, which I don't know if we can build that yet. So yeah, we're gonna have to go back, guys. And uh, 
I guess we'll start looking at, at base build and stuff. Maybe not get the base fully built or anything like that, but maybe start figuring out what we want to do, like where we want to put it. And uh, also see if there's anything we can do about getting over here. See, I, I already know we don't have a suit, a new suit to get, but we might be able to get the... Um, yeah, what are that? What was that called? Like the mobile vehicle bay or something like that. The the one oh, that allowed okay, you to craft yeah. the vehicles. And then yeah, maybe, maybe we can get that one vehicle because I want to say that we might have gotten the schematic for that. If I'm not mistaken. Oh, and of course this ran out right when we're being attacked. It always runs out at the most inconvenient time. I think this was trying to scare you away from it. It's yeah, in. yeah, I think that's what's going on here. Mm-hmm. Need to get an egg. I want to pet the kitty fish. I really need more animal partnerships in this game, I feel. Yeah, because the game's so lonely without them. Mm hmm. I feel like it, there's something chasing me. One of those, I thought that was a giant turtle. One of those guys is chasing me right now. It's I'm not even going to look here. behind this, guys. I didn't want none of it. He's chasing you. He might have been. I just outrun him. I'm too fast. Purple flowers. What we'll want to do is, while we're heading back there, is maybe just kind of take a peek and see if we can't find anything that might be useful. That's shiny. Oh. Uh, we might want to get this for the, uh, for the titanium. True. Because the, uh, crafting, the, the base crafting, again, that's going to require quite a bit of that. Also, apparently, we got really lucky with, um, God, what is the, the name of that? Oh, I've forgotten the name of it. The little shelf thingies? Oh, yeah? The what storage? are they called? No, 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 no. No, the little shelf thingies that are hanging off the coral, t oh. coral table. That's the name of it. Apparently, we got really lucky finding those because, unlike the first game, which those were everywhere, mm -hmm. like it was not difficult to find those in the first game, uh, apparently, they're very rare in this one. Really? And so, yeah, everybody's saying if you see those, you need to like get as much as possible. Interesting. Because it's difficult to find them. So yeah, if we see any more of those, which is kind of what I'm looking for, or just anything really, we'll, uh, we'll grab it up. I'm wondering what kind of crazy shit's going to be in this game. Yeah, well yeah, and plus you have the, the land element as well, and there's more critters on the land where I think the last game they didn't really have any any land critters outside of those crab thingies. But yeah, you got the, the land critters now too. Mm -hmm. but yeah, I'm interested to see what kind of crazy stuff we find, especially as we go deeper and deeper yeah. in the game. Because that's one thing that you don't really expect, is like, you know, you think you've seen it all, and then this game whips out something something amazing. Probably big. The tree. Wants to eat you. I, I wouldn't be surprised if, if we could find it now. We probably just need to, like, go to the location. I might have to look that up online. Uh, the way these, the uh, Subnautica games seem to work is that these commands can be found in certain locations, certain biomes. So I think if we went to a certain biome, then we might be able to find the schematic for, for the mobile vehicle base so we get that crafted. And that would allow us to go there. And that's the only really thing the only real thing I think we could get easily. Mm -hmm. Any like suit upgrades, I don't know that we could get those guys. So what we might want to do Yeah, I could just go exploring. I and mean, we need parts anyway. Did we have any other point of interest that we were looking to go no, to? No, no, that's all we got right now, Jinx. Mm. So, yeah, I think we'll just we'll just go out and see if we can't find that, because that'd be the best thing to do. And and no matter what, we're gonna need more parts. As you can see here, guys, I don't think we have quite enough stuff. Lead apparently is another thing we're gonna need. It's kind of a bummer though, because I really wanted to go over there, uh, because last episode we spent gathering resources. Now we're gonna go exploring. Well, what we need to do. Is figure out where we want to build our base, Jinx. True. Like, what's a good location? Should we stay close to here? Should we find somewhere better? And this is a pretty good spot. It's all right, but there's not a lot of space for building. True. Because it's kind of tight. I don't know. Why don't you guys uh, put some suggestions down in the comments? Some of you that have played this game or are playing this game right now. And maybe give some suggestions for where you think would be a good location for us to build our base at. And it's going to be a beginner base, so it doesn't have to be a, the perfect location. But I would imagine that this is not the best location, guys. It just seems like it's too crowded. There's not enough, like, deep spots True, I guess and open areas. Too. Yeah. For us to really have... I mean, you don't need a ton of space for building, but... What's that? You know what that is. Oh. It's a titan hole fish. I'm just trying to go in his hole. 
He just hangs out like that. Ah, waiting can't get for in there. things to, <laughs> to, to go shoot in through his hole. hole. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so there is salt here. Remember when we were looking for salt? Yeah. I can always find it. it when I don't want it. We'll pick it up, though. That'll be useful for any future expeditions we go on. You need oxygen. Oh, yep. Oxygen. All right, let's take a dip, get a little bit of air here real quick. Actually, a really beautiful, calm night tonight. I don't see that very often. Seems like it's always storming up there. Seems like it's always storming in the day. There's a lot of storms in this game. Like when you popped your head out before we started recording and then it was morning, it was really it was beautiful. It was really beautiful. Yeah, I was going to like, when we started the episode, I was going to have a start looking up at the sky, but then we went back up and it was cloudy again. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't take long. You got to hit the sun first thing in the morning. Huh. That's interesting. This is all closed off. Can you not go beyond it? Now it looks like morning. Is this a cave? Oh. Yeah, that's what it seems like. There's something here. Oh. Oh, it is a cave. All right, well, That's let's go. Cool. Let's go exploring, guys. I was gonna do on land exploring, but why not? Is it cold out here? I uh, guess. Yeah, I think it's always cold. So that's why you have to use these here. I think that's yeah, supposed always. to be like the main resource that you have to manage when you're up in. It's your oxygen. Yeah. Yeah, it's basically like the oxygen. Because mm -hmm. if you're gonna have more land zones, then you know you gotta add. Something equivalent to that, I suppose. I mean, you don't have to, but if you're trying to be a dick... <laughs> you have to. <laughs> yeah, make your game harder. You can't make a survival game and not be a dick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I feel like there's a certain so type of personality. you player. Yeah. Oh, what's that? A forklift? Can we, Can we build a forklift? It? Probably not. So let me scan the oh. forklift, damn it. I thought this was a snowman at first. Oh, it is a snowman. Oh my god, don't destroy him. I'm gonna scan him. Although... So we can make mask. we can make a snowman now. Can you take his mask? That's what I'm trying to do. Nope. Aww. <laughs> so I just destroyed well, that snowman sad. for nothing. It feels like there should goodies. be some schematics here, guys. Yeah, let's go dig around and see what we can find. At the very least, we'll find more water and stuff. Up, oh, prawn suit. Nice. Okay. That was something you didn't get until much later in the game. In the first one. There's somewhere to go inside and warm up. So we would need four of those. Yeah, we do need to get warmed up. Oh, there's here. another one. Is the flowers the only thing there is to warm ourselves on here? Yes. Yeah, and they're in all the way over here. Ah, I'm going. Like we're trying. <laughs> all right, so we need to manage that a little bit better, guys. We were excited. Mm -hmm. There's goodies. There's a snowman. Got me all excited. Oh, it's raining on us too. Oh. I, I wonder if that'll affect your mm. your cold level because it should. But yeah, you'd think. See if there's anything over here, and then we'll hit the the flower at one more time. We need to find something closer to that area to heat ourselves up on, or maybe go inside. Yeah, see if we can go inside. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because this is not gonna work having to come run it back over here each time. Yeah, I'm really hoping we can find, I, I doubt it, but if we could find the entire prawn suit, we'll go over there in the prawn suit. There is one more fragment, I think. Although, do we need the mobile vehicle bay to make right. the uh, the prawn suit? So there's one more what? One more fragment. To oh, yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, I want to see if I can go inside, though. Looks like it. Yeah, it looks like we can actually, well, we can oh. scan it. This is the large oh, room fragment. So this is nice. something new. And one of the interesting things. Oh, shelter. really? Oh, oh that's well, we sucks. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have to go in here. But yeah, one of the new things is that you can now like separate the room up. Like build walls oh. to like separate the room into many different parts. Oh we need to get that vending machine. Snacks. Snacks. We need snacks. Yeah, I think what we're gonna do next episode is just have a, a base building episode or something like that. Uh, Alien Intruder, a game of deception, aliens, and paranoia. Ooh. Is that like Among Us or something like that? <laughs> Looks like it might have most of the stuff in here. Ooh, a motivational poster. It's your field. Stand tall. Be singular. posters were banned from Xenoworks following a lengthy discussion at the annual company retreat three years ago. This poster is technically contraband. I like contraband. Nice. <laughs> lantern fruit. I love lantern fruit. Those are good, man. 
And we got planters. Uh -huh. Yeah, we got the good planters. Our place is going to be nice. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, this increases body up. heat. Nice. All right. Well, we can use that outside. Let's grab a couple of these. Now, we don't want to use them all, obviously. Uh, we do need to scan this real quick. Yeah, I might want to keep one of the seeds, although we are running out of space. It seems like it's not taking the seed. Oh, there we go. Never mind. <laughs> I don't know if these go bad quickly. Hopefully not. We're going to eat one. All right. Nope, can't scan that. There's a lot of lantern fruit all over the place. Yeah, you wouldn't think that they would go bad quickly, but... We got task a lists locker. or something. You can't scan that? I think we already have that. Oh. I think we might actually, we either either already scanned it, or we should start with it. Oh yeah, power cell charger. Yeah, we need that. Okay, that was another stuff. thing we didn't have too much later. I wonder if we were supposed to come over here yet. No, I think we stumbled upon it. We, I really wish we had brought our flash. Oh, we did bring our flashlight. Okay, let's go ahead and put it into the quick slot. Not entirely sure why the motivational poster was there. Maybe so <laughs> we can pull it out, get motivated. Get motivated. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. This is the uh, the bulkhead thing, isn't it? Oh, this will be super helpful in our base as well. This is one thing I was kind of worried about was, um, you know, how we were going to keep the, the structural yeah integrity. the structural integrity up. But yeah, like with that, huge. that should do it. Yeah, I don't think we we're supposed to go here yet. I wouldn't be was surprised if we get a mission Sam's to come here. Space? What was she doing all the way out here? There's something that we could scan here. I missed it. What was it? I saw a little thing pop up. Maybe not. Oh, it's probably this. Oh. You can name nameplates, big nameplates. You were wondering if we could do that, Jinx. Nice. Well, here we go. All right, so this is probably about Sam. I don't think I have a choice. I have to neutralize the bacteria myself. I'm a little nervous. Okay, terrified. But this thing is a death sentence. We shouldn't be messing around with it. I'm no biologist, I know. So does everyone else here. I haven't spoken to Danny since we fought about it. Zeta said she'd handle it and then didn't. Lil practically begged me to drop it. This is completely beyond the scope of your work. You have to stop before you jeopardize your standing with the company. <laughs> I don't want good standing with a transgov that would do this. Robin tried to warn me. Maybe she was right, and Altera really is unfixable. Maybe I deserve better than this. We all do. I've synthesized the antibacterial agent. <laughs> I know my biochem at least well enough to do that much. I've stashed some away in one of the Pengling research caves, southeast of the Leviathan. That was probably the easy part. Now I just have to carry out the plan. Focus. Be brave. Worry about what happens next after the threat is neutralized. They're going to know it was me. If they send me home, what? when they send me home, where the ice isn't 20 feet thick, I can get my Augie bun back. We can cuddle under a nice warm blanket. Things with Robin will thaw out. They always do. Besides, I think she'll respect this. And then, Maybe I'll start my own research outfit with an awesome team. I'd love to work on prosthetics again. Help people find peace and ease in their bodies. No more cold. No more spying. Nothing that can be misused. <sighs> All right. Now's my time. I've got this. All right. So I figured we listened to those ones that have to do with our sister. But overall, we're not going to be able to listen as much as we did in the last one since they come out of the damn controller. I wish there was an option to change that. I didn't look if there was, though. Let me just double check. But I want to say that there's no option for changing that, guys. Oh, controller speaker. Where? Enable controller speaker. Oh. Well, that might actually work out for us. I didn't even look in controller. I looked here in general where all the sound settings were. All right. Well, that works out. Uh, so we might be able to have it go through uh, the game instead, that would work out a lot better, guys, because, yeah, I'm going to tell you what, it, it's it's just too low from what I saw. I, I tried increasing the sound to make it a little bit louder, but, yeah, I feel like this, uh, this will work out a lot better, guys. I wish I'd looked at that sooner. The picture. Can we scan that? Of your sister. Oh, hold on, what's this? Oh, I thought this was a penguin. 
<laughs> poster. I was all excited. It's like a we'll pick it up, robot. Though. I saw the sister poster, but oh, we can't pick it up. That must be Tato. Augie Bun. Oh, you were a good cat. Never the mind. cat's name was Potato, huh? <laughs> Who's Augie Bun? I don't know. Yeah, see, I was thinking that the scan each nameplate. Yeah, I think that gives you oh, information I, about the oh, person. Oh, okay, I see. Did we get this bookshelf thingy over here? Yeah, it looks like either we already have it or we can't get it. Anything else? I just want to make sure I don't miss anything, guys. Uh, I like that we got this this window thing here, though, because I think this is a window where we'll have the blinds. Oh, yeah. But maybe not. Above ground? Yeah, nothing else here. And some Another more pictures. Poster. Oh, here's this. Ah, oh, my darlings, Brian, Svea, and Oren, I'm counting the days until I can come home and give you all the hugs and kisses. Since my research project was cancelled, they have me at a place called Outpost Zero doing nothing much. Just cataloguing things, plants, the occasional animal, but it's mostly ice where I am, so there's not a lot of new stuff to find. Svea and Oren, you know how you get bored when your hover dance teacher makes you practice skills 15 minutes over schedule and it eats up your freestyle time? It's a bit like that. But I have a new roommate, Samantha, a roboticist. You should see her little bangling box. Oren, you'd love them. But she got management upset. I guess this is just where they send you if they decide you're too much trouble. I'm kind of glad she's here, though. I was getting lonely. I'm still trying quietly. I don't want any more trouble to figure out where I went wrong. I was sure. I picked up a distress signal. I, I was right on top of it, and then it just stopped. What if someone, an architect, is still down there and, and needs help? I'll be home before I ever get to find out, and it will fall to some future researcher to come and find out, I guess. I, I hope. But oh, I can't wait to be home with you. When are you going to send me some more art? There's still a patch of bare wall here that could use some color and a touch of genius. I miss you. I love you. I hope you're still proud of me. I'm proud of you. Yeah, that's going to work a lot better, guys. Been able to do it through there. So we got an ion cube. A lot of stuff to scan here. Uh, one of the things I wanted to wait to scan, because this here, the modification station, this is incredibly important. Yeah, that's going to be super helpful to have. Uh, the modification station allows us to, to build a bunch of things, uh, like some upgrades. You know what? Our inventory is going to be like full <laughs> of pictures, man. Well, oh, whatever. We gotta get the cat picture. Oh, potato. I have all the potato I pictures. Little couch walrus. Pick up this as well. And we should probably drink some water. We're quite thirsty right now. You know, actually, we could eat. Oh, no. These do go rotten. Oh, do they? Yeah, you can see they're oh, going rotten right now. That went kind of quick. Yeah. All right, well, we're gonna eat one. And then. What is the question mark? Okay. Uh, maybe it just doesn't have a Yeah, it just doesn't have icon. an icon there. Uh, so, where is our water? It's right here. This is our last water. Yeah. All right, so we're in a little it pickle there. It didn't fill us up by much. Don't take your kids to work day. I don't think we're going to listen to that one, guys. We've already listened to a couple. Architect research right? notes. Could there be architects? We won't this listen planet? to this one. Altera really messed up if they got that one wrong. Well, let's kind of scroll through here and see if there's anything Signal important. Location uploaded to PDA. Okay, so this gave us a new location here. Architect Sanctuary. Alright, so I think that's probably the next one in the storyline here of trying to find her sister. She's dead. You think so, Jinx? Yeah. I don't know. She might still be alive. It's not impossible. Control room tech. Okay, so I mean, we are getting like all kinds of useful stuff here, guys. Now, I know that there's something else to scan in here. What is hmm. that, the charger? Mm, I don't know. I was thinking that had to do with like the, uh, you know, the uh, the area where you had your, your Seamoth? Oh, maybe. I don't know. It looked like that. Can I not fit in here? I took a picture. <laughs> 
Memories. <laughs> that picture that will never be to delete. Alright, so I guess I'll go through here next. I thought there was something that I missed here. Maybe not. Okay, yeah, I guess that's it. We still need to go outside. Let's go over here. I don't know how longer, how much longer we'll be able to explore, guys, because See we need... Again. Well, yeah, it's also the end of the episode, <laughs> but we need water and all that kind of stuff. But, I mean, man, like, you don't want to leave this. Like, there's too much good stuff to get. Like, I feel like we got to get everything while we're here. Everything. Mm-hmm. We'll see if there's any more of these prawn suit things we can scan. Yep, there's one. Or we need uh, three more of these guys. Two more after this, right? Yeah, two more. All right, so it's just snow. The being able to pick up snow off the ground throws me off. Makes me think that there's something I need to do there. Yeah, Anything you need in to here? Pick up some snow. I just have snowballs taking up all our inventory. <laughs> snowballs and camp pictures. Seems all you like need, it I guess. wouldn't be that cold outside. It seems warm out. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go back in, get warm real quick. Freezing her tits off right now. Go, go, go. Yeah, and then just try and run over to this area. Like as fast as we can. See if there's anything to scan. Oh well there there's uh some some plants in there we can warm ourselves on. Uh not seeing anything. But yeah, this was a great find, guys. Again, I, I think we did kind of go a little bit ahead of the story here. We got carried away. Mm -hmm. Well I just well, was exploring, exploring and then I found it. And it wasn't that far from our base. Oh, we got dark quick. Yeah. Let's hurry up and get warmed up. There might be something in here, too, to explore. Monsters. There's always monsters. What's that red thing to the right? The oh, rock? Uh, yeah, I thought it was like a crystal. All right, so there's nothing else over here, right, that I missed? I don't think so. All right, so we'll, we'll dip in here real quick and see if there's anything over here. And then we'll probably just end the episode and then I'll head back home off camera. Yeah, we'll see if there's anything interesting over here. I'd hate to do this off camera and then there'd be something amazing. Yeah, it feels like there's something. Mm-hmm. Yep, of course there was something. In fact, this reminds me of like the area where you put the ion cube. Can we put the ion cube yeah. in there? I don't know. I feel like there's something to pick up right here. Oh, it's just snow. Just That's just snow. a snowball, guys. I got excited for nothing. I'm gonna take a look. I don't I don't think that's the ion cube thing. I think it's it's similar to that. It looks like it though. Okay, yeah. If we were able to do that, then we'd be able to just interact with it, because you don't need to have it in your your hand or anything. But yeah, it looks kinda like that. But yeah, we'll likely see some of the same like alien bases. Oh, here's one right this here. This is indoors. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Let's scan this here. I don't know if that's important at all, but we'll scan it anyways. We're Amazing curious, stuff. folks. I don't think there's anything else so over there. Glowy. I wonder if we'll have those tablets again. All those different tablets that we have to interact with. Oh, yeah, maybe. Yeah, like to get that open. Although I'm not seeing anywhere to put the tablet. So we can get inside the alien base. Hmm. Maybe you got maybe that thing that we're looking at is where you have to put the tablet. I don't know. I don't think so. That doesn't look like the the thing where you put the tablet. I'm thinking that we'll probably exit through here at another point in the game. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, like we'll be on the other side or something. Because yeah, I'm not really seeing anything to interact with here, guys. There's a terminal on that. Oh, never mind. That's coffee maker or whatever. Yep. Jinx said this is a terminal. No, on the other side. <laughs> I thought that. Oh, you thought this was? That baby coffee maker. Baby coffee was a maker. Terminal. I think that's it, guys. I think that's all there is to interact here. Now, maybe I missed something. Maybe not. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I think that's it. All Need right. A beacon here. Yeah, we should definitely put a beacon in this location. Uh, but we don't have any beacons, so we won't be able to do that right now. We'll have to do it at some other points, maybe when we're around the area. But yeah, I definitely want to know where this is. Although, again, I don't think there's anything here that we're missing right now. And I also think that we might see the story direct us over here. Which, in which case, we'd get a beacon over here. It would be able to turn off and on. That's what I'm assuming is happening. They didn't put all this here not to send you there in the story, guys. Yeah. Yeah, so I expect... Uh, I think we just moved ahead of the story a little bit. 
That's one of the things in this game, though, is most of the stuff isn't closed off from the beginning. If you can get there, now a lot of it's like deep or whatever in the first game I'm talking about. A lot of it's like really deep, so you might not be able to get there just because you can't go that deep. I feel like there's got to be another prawn suit thing I can scan. <laughs> I really want the damn prawn suit. I, I think you do you need two. how many you want. All four, things. In one spot. I feel like you might know. Oh, I didn't mean to close oh, that. No. <laughs> I'm going to freeze out here because I'm closing doors. I feel like you might need that mobile vehicle bay, though, uh, to make that one as well, guys. So I don't think we'll be able to make it, even if we did have all four parts. Oh, this was... We need to scan this. I can't believe I walked right by this. This is incredibly important. Water filtration machine. Oh, yeah. I'm glad we came back here. Yeah, so we can filtrate water, and uh, this will make water for us as well as salt. And also give us salt, since so it takes the salt out of the water. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be super helpful for our base. Though it does require a lot of power, and I don't know if we'll be able to power that just yet. Alright, so yeah, I think we got everything in here. I mean, shit, I'm going to make one last round in here, because we you see we just missed this, and that was really important. Definitely not something we wanted to miss. Maybe get a couple more lantern fruit, uh, bring back home. But yeah, uh, that's actually going to be the end of today's episode. We did go over a bit, didn't we? Yeah, yeah we went over did. a little bit. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, make sure you leave a like on it, subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. I do hope to see you guys on the next episode, and thanks for watching.